Hi, my name is Parker Eugen Giovan. I'm 15 years old. Adoption is the transfer of a kid from its birth mother to another parent. And what it means to me is that I can have a chance of living a better life than I would have in the previous one I was given. My mom wanted to keep the originality of my Korean name, but still make it sound American. So my full name in Korea was Park Yujin. So she made Yujin my middle name, added Giovan to my last name, and added the E-R to Park. I think it helps me have a new identity other than my Korean self, but I still am connected to my culture. I think I've been told all my life that I was by my parents. They made sure that I knew from an early age. So maybe when I was three or around that age. It didn't feel any different from anybody else because my family was very welcoming. I actually have a lot of friends that are also adopted so they have a variety of different ideas and opinions about how it is, but they don't really care about it. I'm just the same. I have been uh, teased sometimes by certain people and, you know, called names and stuff like that, but never have I really been held back because of my adoption. The hardest part is knowing that there is a person out there who knew you and had a personal connection to you but you don't get to see them again. I do feel lucky I was adopted by a loving family. I feel very lucky that I was uh, adopted into a family that lives in New York City because I love this city a lot. I went to a reunion uh, created by the Spence Chapin the Adoption uh, Foundation and there was a lot of adopted children there from China, from Korea, from a lot of places and there was a lot of foster mothers there who had flown from Korea and other countries to meet kids who were adopted and kids they actually raised for a while and I was the first child that my foster mother had ever cared for during the time where I was going to be adopted and I met her and I told her my name and she started uh, crying and I didn't know that I had an effect on other people like that and that my adoption was not only an experience for me to go through, but it was also a very big experience for other people. And it was hard for a lot of people, I think, for my birth mother and for my foster mother, who cared for me for six months before I flew to the U.S. And she actually presented me with a hand-knit picture, actually, of with my initials in it, and hugged me, and we talked through a translator. Adoption to me is very sensical and very natural as well. Um, it's the replacement of something that wouldn't be so great and giving it a new meaning and a new beginning. Um, and it is very natural. Penguins, in fact, adopt chicks that were left behind by their parents. So it is very commonplace for even animals to adopt. It's not strange to be adopted. A lot of people do it, and I think there needs to be more adoptions because there's plenty of other people out there who need loving families. So you're looking at watches, Parker? Yeah, I'm trying to buy one. Yeah. What's your favorite one? Uh, I like the silver ones, not the gold ones. They're too flashy. How was school? It was good. I had a geometry test day. Ooh, was it hard? Did you study? I did study. No, it wasn't hard. It wasn't Just that hard? Just five questions, yeah. Oh, that's good.